Mm-hmm. So you what happened to you? They get caught. I was in the store. But my mom has it. As you see, she has a whole lot. There's a whole lot of uh, medication. She's pretty much like a walking, a walking drug store. So I walk out, I go to the shoes and drive my Jeep around. And as they're talking to us, so hectic. they are being almost school year and people with the last minute kids at school as fast as the kids. So I walk out, I go to the Jeep, and I look over and see him smoking. The first thing I thought was, oh, uh, a car over here. Or a vehicle, or a vehicle. I look, and I didn't see her. And I looked at it, it was the thing looking for her. I was hoping it wasn't my way to come over. And all of a sudden, I was in these big, global flames. I didn't think it's kind of as worried about her as so she was. Uh, you know what I mean? Uh, and she's picked up a phone call and the thing will just burst the thing. And luckily, what she says is that she was driving and she saw it. She said, it's the way you park and there was like steam coming out. And she thought the same thing I did was, uh, it'll hit the car reader. And then all of a sudden, you just see the guys were smoking and smoking and smoking and stuff smoking. And they got out and smoking. And they backed up, and this is way back up, it burst into flames, and uh, everybody started rushing the lady who was driving the car. And, Thank God she's okay. And you know, she lost the car, the tire thing, I mean, it's a white car. You know, it's like not crispy, it's like black, crispy. Yeah, the law said it scared the life out of her. She wanted to get, you know, I mean, when she saw me, she was, mm-hmm. she wanted to get out of there, but I wanted to see what was going on with the footage, you know, me, I didn't have the footage, and also we had, you know, a little bird, you know, for the birds, so I feel like being the birds, to see this, who I call my friend, you know, we, and my family, you know, we go to Walmart, they see that they recognize the sheep when it comes up in your thing. So, they come over there, they're waiting for us, so it's just it's like a ritual for us. But I just wanted to let y'all know that. And, and everybody's okay. And the other crash, I had only home. We had to find another way to go home, so we had to back up. Because uh, it was just taking so long. Uh, I really had have speed bumps. This is, you know, a residential area. Uh, well, it looked like somebody slowed down to go to speed bumps, and the other person was going fast, and ran right into the back of that, that, that one person's car. And, but the second person in the back car is the one that got hurt, uh, the passenger. So, you know, as you see, you know, the the driver of that car came up and was asking, and then, at the end, uh, uh, if, if they was okay. I don't know if he did before we got there or what. But it was crazy, you know, that was just one crazy day. You know, it's been pouring down rain here today, lightning, thundering, and everything. Uh, it scares me because we have kids behind this camper. We all have a good night. I just wanted to show you that. Hit that subscribe button, get Sharon to 1,000 subscribers, help her with her bucket list.